Following her defeat at the People's National Party's presidential election polls yesterday, November 7th, Lisa Hanna has extended her gratitude to her supporters and has issued her congratulations to Mark Golden on his victory. Congratulatory messages have also come in from the former president, Dr. Peter Phillips. Outgoing president of the People's National Party, Dr. Peter Phillips, has issued his congratulations to the newly elected president, Mark Golden, who won the PNP's presidential elections on November 7, 2020. According to Dr. Peter Phillips, he is urging the entire party, including all members, affiliates and supporters, to unite in full support of the leader as the political organization embarks on the task of charting the way forward in keeping with the progressive tradition and the need to strengthen the PNP's political concerns. Mark Golden secured victory over Member of Parliament for Senan Southeastern Lisa Hanna by 296 votes. Mark Golden received all of 1,740 votes, while Miss Hanna got 1,444 votes. Approximately 3,500 delegates were eligible to vote, and approximately 96% of them turned out to cast their ballots on November 7, 2020. True Warrior Style And as a graceful challenger, the defeated People's National Party's presidential candidate, Lisa Hanna, has extended her thanks to her supporters, who provided her with adequate support during Saturday's elections. Lisa Hanna, who is a member of parliament for Senan Southeastern and the shadow minister for foreign trade and foreign affairs, was beaten by Mark Golden, who is a member of parliament for St. Andrew Southern and the spokesperson for finance. In a statement coming from Miss Hanna, she mentioned that she has extended her congratulations to Mark Golden. She further went on to state that she would like to sincerely thank all the delegates who voted on Saturday, November 7th. The campaign has been extraordinary for her, and she has enjoyed and loved every moment of the journey, walking with them and talking with them. She further went on to mention that I've called Comrade Mark Golden and congratulated him on his victory. I committed my continued service and support to the party and to him as our new leader. We have much work to do and must come together in love and choose unity. To my indefatigable presidential campaign team and comrades in arms that worked tirelessly to bring us together and to make this campaign possible across the length and breadth of Jamaica. Thank you for everything you have done. To my family, with their love and support, I have walked through countless fires with you. To my wonderful husband Richard and to my son Alex, thank you for standing by my side every step of the way. I further mention that, and as I speak about my family, I must of course say a special thanks also to my Caesar family. I thank you for your support, I thank you for your love, and I thank you for the lessons you have taught me over the past 13 years that I have been privileged to represent you. Here's the new beginnings. Thank you. Let's continue to bring back the love in our party and our country. The presidential election results were announced yesterday. The supporters of Mark Golden were celebrating in the rain at the People's National Party's headquarters after he was declared the winner of the party's presidential election. Many persons shouted out John Gliss and supporters said this in reference to his St. Andrew Southern constituency, which includes the PNP stronghold of Hornet Gardens, better known as the Concrete Jungle. As Mark Golden entered the PNP headquarters on Holdoop Road, many persons shouted, We say Golden. A handful of supporters of the other candidate, Lisa, were also at the headquarters, but they were very silent. The real deal is now the president. That is what was declared by one of Mark Golden's supporters as she was trying to reach to touch the elm of his garment. Young people did this, declared another Golden supporter, 
who mentioned that she is a member of the PNP's youth organization. Mark Golden managed to take victory from Lisa Hanna's hands by approximately 296 votes to Lisa Hanna's 1,144 votes. And this is the largest margin of victory in any PNP presidential election in recent time. But of course, this information comes on the heels of the 2019 presidential elections when, of course, Dr. Peter Phillips only managed to secure victory from Mr. Bunting by 76 votes. So this approximately 300 margin of victory is huge for Mark Golden and his presidential team. Based on the actions and statements coming from Lisa Hanna, after the conclusion of the November 7th PNP presidential elections, it seems like she is a very gracious contender. And of course, she seems to be graceful in defeat as well. However, it seems as well that she is ready to take on the mandate of helping Mark Golden to rebuild, re-energize, re-engage, and reform the People's National Party. Of course, she is standing in agreement with the code of conduct and the behavioral documents and agreements that were signed previously however it is very good to see that she was able to extend her congratulations to mark golden and that is commendable she is still a warrior in defeat but she is a warrior nonetheless and she did exceptionally well by garnering 1444 votes it's just that she was bettered by Mark Golden with his 1,740 votes. Of course, this is the highest margin of victory that has been attained by a president in these recent times. However, the, the task at hand is for the party to be reunited and for everyone to work together to rebuild, reform, re-energize and engage all those who are associated with the political organization and Mark Golden and Lisa Hanna seems to have a plan to work towards rebuilding and uniting the various teams and groups within the party. Do you agree and do you appreciate the way that Miss Hanna has taken to extending her congratulatory message to Mark Golden? And do you also appreciate her message that she looks forward to working with Mark Golden and other members of the PNP team to ensure that their political organization moves towards a better future? Of course, if you think otherwise, please feel free to leave your comments down below. And if you are extremely proud of these two candidates, you should say so as well. They have both done well. It's just that both persons could not have been victors. So, Mark Golden is the victor in this race. And of course, he has the support of Miss Hanna and the support of Bunting and the support of many critical members in the PNP, including Omar Davies, Adrian Nicholson, Angela Brown Burke, and some other critical members of his presidential campaign team. They have all done well, and therefore, their task is to rebuild, reform, re-engage, and also to seek funding for this party. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. And please remember to share the content across various social media platforms. And of course, encourage your friends and family to watch the content and subscribe as well. Be safe and ensure that you stay dry and warm during this very cold weather. And the weather is also rainy as well, so bring your umbrella if you decide to leave home. Be safe. Goodbye.